Hi everyone and welcome to Protocol 36 and in today's video we'll be speculating whether or not Marvel Spider-Man 2 will have customizable suits. This video was suggested by MickeyXS11 once again who has a channel of his own where he does a lot of live streams so I highly suggest you subscribe and check it out. Also before we get started if at any point you enjoyed this video I'd really appreciate if you could drop a like as that would really help out the channel. Thank you. Let's dive into this. Now this is a topic a lot of people have been wondering for a long time. If Marvel Spider-Man 2 is going to allow us to customize our own Spider-Man suits. Kind of similar to how Injustice 2 did. Which allowed us to add different types of gears and equipment onto our own suit. For available DC characters. And pretty much overall create a brand new suit. So would we get something like that in Insomniac's upcoming Spider-Man sequel? Personally as much as I would love to see this. I don't think that's something Insomniac would do. It's not impossible and could one day happen. But one of the reasons why is because I feel like it would take too much time for Insomniac to create different types of gear, equipment and other elements. That's not to say Insomniac can't do it whatsoever, I think they could if they want to, but I feel like they would rather add more suits in the next game than most people want, and also create their own original suits, like they've done with both Spider-Man PS4 and Spider-Man Miles Morales, as well as creating different types of gadgets for both Peter and Miles. Assuming we do also get to play as Miles in Marvel Spider-Man 2, which in my opinion is very likely. Of course gadgets that would be very suitable for both characters in order to continue to make them feel different from each other. Like they already do in their own solo games and since they're already doing that i feel like just adding customizable suits would just be something they might not add in another marvel spider-man game especially if the rumors of having symbiote variants of each spider-man suit are true more on that later on but right now i feel like in some level rather design their very own spider-man suits for everyone to unlock and use and all with other suits from the comics films and possibly even shows rather than allowing us to create and build our very own suits or even combining other suits together one of the other reasons why i don't think we'll get customizable suits in Marvel Spider-Man 2 is because since it will be about the symbiote storyline I think all of Insomniac's attention will be going into not only the story but also the suit or suits they're going to be making when it comes to the Venom symbiote as I think it will be pretty obvious that that they will allow us to switch between the advanced suit and the black suit whenever we want while also adapting the iconic story respecting the source material while also making it their own and different from past incarnations I think adding customizable suits would kind of take that away when that's not what the game will be about. Like how the gear system was a huge deal in Injustice 2, which made sense because it's a fighting game. While Marvel Spider-Man 2 would be a single player open world game. It could still work but again, it's more likely that Insomniac will lead more towards that rather than creating a completely new and different feature in their Spider-Man sequel. Personally, I do think customizable suits do belong in Spider-Man games and it's something I definitely want. But I don't think it will be a feature we will see at least for a while. But if Insomniac comes out and says otherwise, then I'm happy to be wrong. Even if I end up being surprised by it. Because at the end of the day, it is something I believe a lot of people have been asking for or at least talked about before Spider-Man PS4 came out so there's definitely a chance but I just think it's way too unlikely when it comes to one of the latest rumors for Marvel Spider-Man 2 it has been reported by fandom via a while ago that there will be symbiote variants for each Spider-Man suit and personally I think that's more likely to happen rather than getting customizable suits in the sequel since it would make the most sense with Venom being the main villain and all but I think this is also unlikely to happen it would be amazing if we do get it but in my opinion I think the only variant symbiote will be getting in Marvel Spider-Man 2 is the Black Raimi suit in Spider-Man 3 which is already one of the most requested suits. As to a lot of people including myself it is pretty phenomenal and works really really well. So assuming we also do get the Raimi suit in Marvel Spider-Man 2 I also think we'll get the symbiote suit from Spider-Man 3 and of course there will definitely be symbiote variants of other costumes like the advanced suit and just like that suit I think it's safe to assume that they will make their very own version of the black suit that will not only look different from the classic symbiote costume but also one that will be the official canon look for their Marvel Universe. I also have no doubt that we'll be getting the original comic book look but I think other types of black suits will be from the comics and even cartoons and even maybe get a star shaded suit that resembles the ultimate version of the symbiote suit which in my opinion would be perfect and I would definitely use it if I got the chance. So personally I don't think we'll get either customizable suits or symbiote variants of every unlockable Spider-Man suit in Marvel Spider-Man 2 but would be amazing if we did. However Insomniac hasn't said anything when it comes to the theories and rumors so until they do never say never. However, what about you guys? Do you think we'll get customizable suit and symbiote variants in Marvel Spider-Man 2? If so, if not, let me know in the comments down below. I would love to hear your thoughts. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Twitter. If you enjoyed this video, please like and one more subscribe to begin Protocol 36.